morning, Mimo tribe. Uh, it's Saturday, June the 20th. Me and Morgan are doing some things here at the apartment. Um, we're going to take y'all with us to the Dollar Tree later. We have to get Dad a gift. And before he start judging us as to why we're getting our gift at the Dollar Tree, he already told us what he wanted. And we can go get them at the Dollar Tree because he's a very simple man. Um, so, yeah, we're going to go to Dollar Tree, get that, and probably some snacks. Because Dollar Tree just got the best snacks to me and Morgan. Um... Hey, Ashley, I love you. Every time I start talking about Dollar Tree snacks, I think about you and the time we went to the one in Miami. The best Dollar Tree I've ever been in in my life. Morgan didn't come. She's jealous. Anyways, we'll catch y'all in the car and stuff later. I just kind of want to do a little intro real quick. Um, honestly, not sure when this vlog is going up. I know we're completely off schedule. Um, y'all will later see why, if you don't already know why. Um, but yeah, so we'll see y'all in the car. All right, y'all, so what had happened was we got carried away doing what we were doing and we're so tired and I realized we hadn't vlogged after we had been in the Dollar Tree. We are not out of the Dollar Tree. Now, let me tell y'all what happened when we was going to Dollar Tree. Yeah, I'm glad we didn't have the camera on. So, we're walking in and this man is like causing a whole scene in the front of the Dollar Tree and he called the manager Fugazi. By chance, if you know the manager or anybody that worked in this Dollar Tree, I'm sorry. But this was absolutely absurd. So he basically, like, it's like 15 people in line, right? And I'm already like, I mean, dang, this is why I don't like coming in the Dollar Tree. And he like, um, every time we come up in here, it's 15 folks in line. You got one person who know what they're doing, working the register, da 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 You fugazi, you in the back chilling. I was like, whoa. It's like that everywhere. Oh. <laughs> Every uh, Dollar Tree, though. They always leave that one person. And I feel so bad for her. She was so sweet, but she was having a hard time. I don't know if they were training her or what, but I mean, she was actually going pretty quick for it to be that many people, but when she rang me up, she made a little oopsie and I had the manager to clear it out, which I understand because she's at McDonald's all the time. Like, uh, sorry, I need a manager. So she cool, but the manager then came out of the back and like it ain't clean in the store. I guess he started doing work after the man put him on blast. Like, he literally put him on blast. And he told um, the girl working the register, like, you don't need to support no man that's like that. He in the back chilling on his butt. You out here trying to do this. Da, 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 da. And they had another man working. Again, apologies if y'all know these people. They had another man working. And he was rude. We was trying to ask him where the toothpick holders was. And he was just not. Like, I just don't believe you should have jobs where you got to interact with people if you're not a people person. Like, you not finna kill my mood because you in a bad mood. So he just wasn't even nice. Like I, This is the most awful experience I've ever had in Dollar Tree. And I'm hungry, so I don't think that helped at all. If y'all notice, I got another wig on. Um, Yeah, I'm having hair issues. So y'all haven't seen this wig before. I actually like this wig. This jet, it needs to be like fixed to where it looks more realistic. But y'all know I don't care enough to do that. So, yeah. Morgan, you want to add anything to that horrible Dollar Tree experience? No, yeah. We were going in there to find two pick holders for my dad because I don't know if I already said that, but that's what he wants for Father's Day, and we couldn't even find none. I think he put us on the wrong aisle, everything. So he was like, you know what, we just gonna go to the Dollar General. I don't know why we tried to switch up anyway. You should have just went to the Dollar General. Ugh. So we're about to do that. Um, got to run back to the apartment though, so we're gonna get her car. I, yeah, I'm so tired. We ain't eight. It's four o'clock. We left the muffins in the microwave. About to take those out. About to eat one. That's what I'm about to do because I'm hungry. To get some to hold us over. I did just buy some. Say, y'all wanna see what I got at Dollar Tree? Morning, show my guy at Dollar Tree. Mm -hmm. So, I think we've already told you on another okay, vlog. No we love these juices from Dollar Tree, the Donald Duck juices. So, I got two apple juices, two orange juices, and a grape juice. I didn't get a fruit punch or they have like a kiwi strawberry. And I think I already told y'all this before, too. I don't like kiwi strawberry drinks. That's just, that's the weird. Here, talk to the people. I gotta get the bag since you don't want to help. I don't want to talk. Talk to the people. Tell them what you've been doing. What is this? What they do, baby? But why you can't talk to the people? Okay, so I told y'all what juices I got. This is what the Donald Duck one looks like, the orange juice. And this is what the grape one looks like. They just had Donald Duck on them. Me and Morgan think they Disney juices. Like, do they sell these at Disney World? I don't know. I don't know. Let's go find out and see. Right, let's find out. Got yeah, some sour patch kids and some peanut butter m &Ms. Oh, let's talk about the diet and how I ain't been on one for two weeks. I still try to eat fairly nutritious meals, but overall, I'm not on a diet right now. And we couldn't run because I have some other things going on that I can't really talk about on the vlog. So, sorry. Got that. Some batteries to go with these AAA batteries I had found at my house or my apartment. So, I got him four C batteries and eight AA. And then I got like eight 
triple at the house. So I'm gonna put those in there with the toothpick holders. Cause all he asked for was the toothpicks that come in the holders. Oh my, that is not enough. So I got him some batteries too. Um, Devin got me some snacks. I got these. These are the cracker pizza ones. Can I see those? And then I got these, which I'm probably gonna share with my sister because we're gonna need lots of snacks here for the next couple of days. Y'all got so much going on. But yeah, I really wanna eat one now. I'm gonna try to hold on. Um, my car is a hot mess. Morgan just here. You don't want nothing. You got nothing to say? Nope. Oh, Lord. You just say make a noodle. Mm -hmm. Okay, so about to go back to the apartment. Um, switch cars. And then when we get to the house and we get back in the, another car. I'm driving, by the way, because people really don't think I be driving. I do drive. Mm. No, she don't. Yes, I do. Then when we get back in the same car again, we'll be back. I totally forgot about the tree. But when we walked in, me and Morgan almost turned back around because we don't play that. And I just couldn't tell what he was on. Cause he was like yelling, like he was causing a whole scene, like sir, and does not take all that. I'm and then he on. called him Fugazi, like what? They is. It's crazy, but uh, yeah. I got a regret shirt, some pack shorts, um, nothing shirting. I have been painting my nails a lot lately, but when we were playing with all that stuff today, and they start chipping, so not cute. I can fix it. Um, I used to paint my nails all the time actually, and I just got out of the habit of doing so. Cause once I start making money, I start going to nails on. But with Corona, my toes look great though. I did a great job. Like y'all, I've been doing base coat, top coat, everything. My toes look great, but my hands because I was doing all that today, I just messed them up. So, all right, we'll catch y'all in the next clip. All right, y'all. So me and I was acting like they don't have sense. We ain't even tried to put the camera in the thing. Just forget it. I'm tired. I just had to handle some more business. So I was like at home, so that threw a wrench in the plans. Anyways, we are on our way to the doll store to get the two picks in the little holders, hopefully. How many did he say he wanted? Three. Three? Yeah, he was going to get three. So he can have them everywhere because he needs two picks. <laughs> uh, then we're going to order El Monte, I think, because I just need some Mexican food and a margarita. So, yeah, that's what we're going to do. And it's, it's about to be 6 o'clock, and I promise y'all I'm probably going to be asleep by 8 because it's been nonstop all day. I've been up since 6 this morning. We've been doing physical work, and I'm just like, no. So, that's the game plan. Probably not taking y'all on the dollar store with us because it's COVID. That too, but we don't need service to actually record. But we just, you know, we're trying to stay a little low-key, you know. Y'all have really seen us do nothing because we haven't been doing anything. And we didn't vlog when we went out of town for my birthday. Like, I know we did a birthday vlog from Morgan. Okay, this one, this is just dangerous. Morgan, take the camera. Mm, running this one. Oh, 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 my edges. Can't see you now. What was I saying? We didn't take the camera to out of town. Cecile, we went for my birthday. Or we took the phone because that's the camera, but we didn't vlog while we was there. Like, we vlogged on Morgan's birthday. But that's because on Morgan's birthday, we, like, went out and about and did a couple things with our parents. My birthday turned up. We ain't vlogging that. So, y'all can see all that. Now. You can follow me on Snapchat if you want to see that. But, um, yeah, so we just didn't do that. And so we just pretty much only go to appointments we have to go to in the grocery store. And because of everything going on, I don't really want to be out and about in the store like, woo, with everything out because germs. So if you didn't know, I'm pretty sure the cases are like not dying down in Alabama. So we still need to be cautious. It's crazy because after Memorial Day, it was kind of like everybody was like, okay, forget Corona. Like, I'm going to live my life. And I don't necessarily think we should be doing that. Granted, have I I've been, been around fine. people? Yes. But we still need to be cautious of the virus. So, there's my little spill. But, um, yeah, I'm not vlogging in the store. I think that's how that started. And we'll probably come back and close the video out once we're at a to waiting on our food because they are doing takeout orders. And I'm going to tell y'all what I'm going to order after this. I'm going to focus on the room and I'm really, really tired. Morgan, you should really say something. No. Because you just I act like you're my assistant. You can still talk even nope. if you don't show them you. Mm -mm. And we just got a Lawler's barbecue on Winchester. Baby. I might not have to have told y'all what street. Whatever. <laughs> but we just got a Lawler's barbecue out here. And I'm going to be the fence because I know that's why. Half the reason why I gained 30 pounds. I had potato dates on Tuesdays for like a year. <laughs> and yeah, you can't even eat See, you can't even eat potatoes that often. You think you're not going to get thick. So, mm. yeah. That's how I'm going to do it. 
<laughs> I was in the potato air Tuesday. Okay, you can turn off. We gotta turn up in the dumpster now, y'all. Y'all, it just has not. You gonna look at the menu? It has not been our day at the dog stores. So when we pulled up to this one, it was some suspicious activity taking place outside. <laughs> um, no, but for real, this lady was on her bike and I guess her boyfriend, I don't know, he kept walking back and forth peeping in the store. And you know me, oh my God, they're trying to rob the dog store. Cause y'all know they do that out here. Anyways, um, then realized he was waiting on his friend to come out. He was trying to see where he was at. Cause they was out here just chilling, you know. And I hate saying this, but they look like they was on drugs. Um, is that me? Mm -hmm. Can I say that? Folks do. Folks can totally look like they're on drugs. Can they not? Anyways, that was my judgment. I could be completely wrong. Never just book by its cover, but it just it was a little suspicious. Anyway, so their friend they were waiting on was in front of me and Morgan, of course, in the line. He was like fixing himself all in his pants. It was really awkward. I was like, what is this man doing? Like, right now, see. Did you just pull your. We, right. That's what I thought he was doing. So. I feel like it is safe to say them folks was on drugs. And you still, you still, you still, you still think it's me to say that? Say that? Anyways, I'm gonna have to ask my mom if I can leave that in because she may say you don't need to be saying folks look like they on drugs, but sometimes you just look like you're on drugs. I don't know how else to say that. Anyways, he got he said something smart to the girl, ringing him up, and she was like, "Okay, like there's really no telling what he said. I won't even pay attention because I was trying to hurry him get out." Um something crazy off the wall not nothing like racist but like i don't know i can't describe it but you could just tell by the energy and the tone that it was like all right so that was going to my feet. my bad oh and i wanted to show y'all why is she acting like i just dropped a brick on her arm you know how happy your person anyway this, we got three of these for my daddy for father's day this is what he asked for so he can keep them one in his truck I don't know where he said he put the other ones, but he he need these around like chapsticks because he also keeps those around too. That's where I get that from. Anyway, and floss. Those always gotta be around. But yeah, so now I'm about to go to El Monte. Y'all, I'm so tired. I feel like y'all can tell when I look tired in the vlog because I'm just, ugh, that's not them. Hey, Finn. I'm definitely ready to go to bed. All right. Last stop, El Monte. Oh, and I put this Germex. Hold on, let me show y'all this. I put this Germex on my purse today because i've been finding a lot in um going through my stuff in the apartment so put it on my purse because rona can't catch a slipping out here with the rona can't move it uh -huh. that's the sun let's see what happens when i yeah i'm breaking out Ugh. sorry y'all are not supposed to see all that not that close i'm just not doing good y'all like i'm just not Okay, Morgan, take this because this is not safe. We gotta stop. We're not doing Okay, speed demon. They just flew off in here. See, that's what I'm talking about. One safe for me to be on the camera trying to drive. Because everybody just be whipping up in the dog so They ain't got no sense. And you would have think in a small parking lot, people would drive 10 miles per hour. No, they want to fly in going 50. Like, kids don't be out and stuff. You can turn it off. Because we're just tired. I had, ooh, because this big old Tahoe was right beside me. I apologize, kids. I apologize for me and my job. That is a nice color. All right. Uh huh. It's the sun. Let's see what happens when I. Yeah, I'm breaking out. Ugh. Sorry, y'all were not supposed to see all that. Not that close. I'm just not doing good, y'all. Like I'm just not. Okay, Morgan, take this because this is not safe. We gotta stop. We're not doing. Okay, speed demon. They just flew off in here. See, that's what I'm talking about. One safety for me to be on the camera trying to drive. Because everybody be just be whipping up in the dog so They ain't got no sense. And you would have think in a small parking lot, people would drive 10 miles per hour. No, they want to fly in going 50. Like, kids don't be out and stuff. You can turn it off because we just going to pick it up. All right, so in case I can't use that clip from the dog store. Where am Monty? I just ordered. Y'all, I'm breaking out so bad. It's just so bad, guys. <laughs> um, but we're at El Monte. I just ordered a number six dinner combo, which is an enchilada and a taco. And then rice and beans. Morgan, you got a what? Mm -hmm. a, she got a Tokitos Mexicano, something like that. And we got some cheese. Tell me why. This is our second time coming to El Monte. Now, the first time I thought they had just charged us wrong. And I was like, hey, whatever. It was $30. It was $30 again. They they put in like a super heavy charge on takeout right now. I don't like that. Have y'all been to Zaxby's lately too? Because my boneless wings meal is like $8. I don't know what's up with that. I don't like that. Ugh. I don't like that. 
they just taking it on up because of the Rona, huh? But I've been listening to Jacquees ja today. It's a vibe. Oh, if you follow me on Twitter, you should follow me on Twitter. If you don't, it's Megan Michelle. It's probably Megan underscore Michelle. Follow me on Twitter. Um, I ain't gonna lie. Like, Twitter Megan, Snapchat Megan, not the same Megan on Facebook. Um, Facebook, like, not that I have to, but I prefer to act like I have way more sense than I do because, uh, you know, like my family follow me on there, my mom and them. Now, my mama follow me on Twitter, and pretty much anything I put on everything else, my mom and them see anyways, but it's just too many people on Facebook, like old teachers, like all of that. Like, my personality's still on there, but I act like I got way more sense than I actually have on Snapchat and Twitter, because Snapchat and Twitter is like, Twitter is like 25, 26-year-old Megan, you know, still young still cute still have fun you know so in case i didn't know that so if you want to see the i don't want to say the other side because it's not like i'm off the chain or nothing but it's a different vibe i feel like on the other apps but yeah morgan's like not talking at all which that's be so weird to me like welcome to the megan show because morgan's just in the background y'all think it's me it ain't me it's morgan she could talk if she wanted to with that being said, follow me on my solo channel, Megan Michelle. I see I have two subscribers. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Go ahead and follow me on there because after this new phase in life, I will be uploading solo type of content. And that will be more personal. Um, more so like for my peers, which, you know, it's odd because we wanted to do Memo for the kids. But it seemed like the kids prefer the content that is really going to be on my solo channel because kids don't really want to be kids and do kid like things kids like to watch grown-ups so that's awkward we still gonna keep the content coming from me i think i've already talked about this before but solo channel gonna be more so like my real life experiences story times for sure because baby i got plenty um you know relationship stuff um all my boss moves that i'm currently in the middle of all that's gonna be on my solo channel which I hope, honestly, I'm just going to go ahead and put it out there. Hopefully, one day, that will become a couple channel. Because I'm convinced whoever I'm going to be with, like, y'all going to see him. Y'all going to see him. He might not, like, want to vlog, but he going to be there. He going to be a little bit more, you know, interactive, you know. So, that'll be cool. Hopefully, y'all can just, you know, grow with me. That'll be neat. That's what I want. That's what I want. I hope I, hope I feel like y'all's girl next door, you know. Like, y'all know me sister cousin friend whatever it may be that's the vibe Mimo was supposed to be giving off to the children like aunties because we got a niece and nephew but we will see y'all just keep us lifted in y'all's prayers i feel like i'm rambling i am rambling but y'all i'm tired like huh? so tired but it's all gonna be worth it and like i can't wait for y'all to see what i've been working on what i've been doing this girl look at morgan face <laughs> oh yeah that ain't cute that's tacky but let me not judge all right y'all I'll show y'all our food when we get to the house and then we go in the vlog.